Hello everyone, welcome back to another video of ray tracing. Now, I've been ha having a lot of questions about what does light do to your character? Your campfires, campfires or, or torches, or any light of that matter. How does it affect the game? And I'm going to try to answer that question for you today. But like in my former video, which was very well received, please do not judge my video based upon what ray tracing looks like, but rather on how informative this was. And once again, without further ado, let's start the video. Now I have made a little macro on ray tracing on, ray tracing off. So if you want to know how I did that, just give me a message and I will show you. So at this point, ray tracing is off. And I'm gonna turn it on now. And just look at the light, see what it does. I'm gonna turn it on now. So we saw a little change here, but we did not see any change over here. Now, let's go to the torch. Because it is on, I'm going to turn it off. And I'm going to turn it back on again. So the shadows changed, but the light on the ground did not. And there's not much shadow here. So let's find a new spot. See how it is over there. We have arrived in our new spot. And let's see if I turn ray tracing on what it does to my shadow because I think we all have seen the Tauren sitting at the, at the bonfire and his light being reflected on the wall or I mean his shadow being reflected on the wall let's see what it does over here ray tracing is now on we don't see any light illuminating me or casting a shadow so let's turn it back off again see what changes It's turned off, no change. So let's find another spot. So I picked this as our new spot and we have some more light and you can actually some reflection of the light here on, on the flag and we have some shadows on the floor and behind this tree there is the sun. Let's see if we can find it. There it is. So that sun is casting a shadow on the floor. And let's, ray tracing is currently turned off, so let's turn it back on. Shadow softened. My shadow changed a bit. Over here, this changed. Let's turn it back off. Personally, I like this better when it's turned off. Better performance. But keep in mind, this is still better. So a lot might change because if I have to believe the screenshot we saw of the Tauren, then we are hopefully in for a treat. <laughs> okay, let's do it one more time. Standing over here, you can see the light. Take a look if it changes. I'm gonna turn it back on now. And I'm going to turn it back off. I don't see that much apart from the shadows. So let's find a new spot. Now, I've showed you Delaram before, but it's much easier now to compare. So let's check it out and try to get a little bit closer look on what it does. is turned on now and you know I'm gonna turn it off so it is turned off and you can see like these hard shadows I'm gonna turn it back on now and take a look at it changed a bit made it a bit softer 
off. There. I did it a bit harder. Now, on to our next spot. So, we are in Silvermoon City now, and I just wanted to show you this spot because this actually made a change. It was, it was quite taking some time to find this spot that actually changed. But I'm gonna turn it on now. Take a look. Did you see that? We actually have some light over here. And the sun illuminated this part. Let me turn it back off. Turning it back on. And turning it off. I like that. We actually have illuminated this part. We have some sun over here. Let's see this this side. Let's see what it is. Turning it off. And I'm gonna turn it back on. Turning it off. And turning it on. Nice. So, let's see if we can find another spot. Now, over here, I've found quite a nice spot as well, which kind of changes the scene. Ray tracing is currently turned off, but I'd like to ask something of you, if you could do me a favor. I am a recently started YouTuber, and I could use all the support I can get. So, if you like my videos, then please do subscribe to my channel because that would help me out greatly. Or give my video a like, or a dislike if you do not like it. But let's continue our comparison. I'm gonna turn ray tracing on. Ooh, that's a nice change. Turning it back off. That is cool. Th this actually, I, I kinda like this, where it it changes the entire scene. It's turned on now. Turning it back off. There we go. Let's see. Let's just keep it like this and... Turning it on. Not much change over here. A little softer. Now, since I made this my thumbnail and I do not want to make clickbait, I figured I'd put this scene in here as well, but the changes are so minor. Take a look. Ray tracing is currently turned off, and I'm going to turn it back on now. Turning it off. And turning it back on. On to the next scene. So, here we are in Thunder Bluff again, and with my new macro it's much easier to show you guys what it does. So it is currently turned off, and I'm going to turn it back on now. There. Turning it off. And turning it on. Turning it off again. And take a look at a different part of the city. Try to cast my own shadow on the floor to see what that does. Zoom in a little. So it is currently turned off, and I'm going to turn it back on now. Turning it off. And turning it on. Did you see it? I saw some changes. So, let's go to the next part. Over here faded away a bit. And some other places. Over here you see some changes, turn it back on again, yeah, very minor. Now this will be my last scene and I all want to thank you very much for watching my video and I really hoped I, you enjoyed it and that I answered your questions. So I found a little fire over here in quite a new area and we have some shadows. That's probably not much different than what we saw before, but let's just take a look at it again. 
Ray tracing is currently turned off, and I'm going to turn it back on again. Turning it back off. And turning it back on. Now let's take one more close look at the shadow, what happens. It is currently turned on. I'm going to turn it back off. And turning it on. And now I'm going to turn it back on before I fry my PC. That would make me very sad because I love making videos. There we go. Thank you very much guys for watching.